Shanu Hur continues our team coverage now, and Shanu is live outside of Mercedes-Benz Stadium in downtown Atlanta with some reaction. Shanu. Yeah, Jeff, with five uh, losses to start this season, I mean, the writing on the wall uh, was pretty much there for this pair right here. Uh, many fans aren't surprised to hear of this firing. In fact, some were even calling for it. As you know, 11 Alive is where Atlanta speaks. And of course, to no surprise, the firings were trending on Twitter tonight with Falcons fans and the sports world in general giving their reactions. So we go to Bradley here who tweeted a sad day for Atlanta Falcons fans. We all knew DQ had to go, but he really is a likable guy and he tried his hardest for the franchise. I hope he does well in the future. But this Twitter user was a little bit more blunt saying it's about time. How are you going to let Quinn follow up a one and seven start last season with a zero to five record this season? It's no secret Dan Quinn's players loved him. This is running back Todd Gurley after today's game before the team announced Quinn's dismissal. I was free agent, and, you know, this guy was one of the, the only guys that gave me a, a call personally and, and reach out to me. So, um, you know, when you know, everybody think I lost it, you know, he believed in me. So, you know, I can't can't do nothing but ride and rock with a guy like that. Yeah, Jeff, and like you mentioned, Dan Quinn created the term brotherhood for this team. But unfortunately, at the end of the day, Jeff, the team just wasn't winning. And that's the bottom line in the NFL. you got to be winning. And, uh, you know, everybody likes Dan Quinn. Everybody. You can download the 11 Alive app to read more about the firings of the Falcons coach and general manager. The story is posted on our homepage. All you have to do is tap the app. So the question is, where do the Falcons go from here? Eric Bieniemy, of course, in Kansas City, getting so much attention right now. But Arthur Blank and the Falcons organization will have to be in a competitive dogfight with other teams that will want to hire him as well, thinking, I, of course, of the Houston Texans. Absolutely. It's been a the, tough uh, fight yeah. ever since the Super Bowl. When I got here, you know, when they first went to the Super Bowl, taking on the Patriots, it's been really tough for those Falcons. Thanks a lot, Jeff. Yep.